Then, in the old days, what happened? Uh, you, you download, when you download at a time, you see the pink one. This is the one that you download. So what do we do? You can uh, wait, well, do some modifications. You can write your name there. Fa chai la, ah, mo ma mi la, ah. You put on that hand, hand hand hold hold la. Okay, you can choose your color. Uh, and in the old days, when we you want to do a, 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 a this uh, handsome folder, what do you need? You have to do what you call mass production. That means, uh, if I want to take pin a uh, pin pieces, uh, what do I need? I need I need order 10,000, 20,000. What do I do? I do a mold. After that, I do injection molding. But nowadays, every piece can be different. Every every piece can have your own signature. Uh, we, we do also a keychain holder over here with the company logo over there. So our world is going to change. Our world is going to change from a mass production concept to a, what we call mass customization. So every piece that produced will be customized to what you need. And uh, some example that expand out, like you go to Magnum. You go to Magnum in Singapore, so what do you do? You make an ice cream that you like. You can make, you can choose the pattern that you like. Every one, every piece is different from the others. You see over here? So they do a, a, a Magnum ice cream, then you can choose. You can do it yourself. So what about what I try to share with you? Uh, to, the, uh, to the HR people instead. First of all, our business model is going to change. Our business model is going to change from a mass production to mass customization. And you must let your staff know about it. People only want to make change when they can see, when they can feel. You keep on telling people what you change. Who are going to change? What is happening? Nobody knows. Only when you can see, when you can feel it, and you can touch it, they are prepared to change. So, 3D printing training, uh, you allow us to see the change. And with that, the step one of change, preparedness. Without preparedness, nobody wants to 